Large before Felton for me was a very dark place, full of regret, missed opportunities, I suppose. So I ended up in Felton because I did a robbery and uh, it was more of a cry for help, sort of desperation attempt of getting away from the people that were in my life, the situation that I was in, and uh, it was just a form of escape. It was only when I came to Feltham and I stepped away from all the madness that goes on in the world that you actually pay attention to yourself and you look inwards and you start to put the pieces together of your past and your present and where you want to be in the future and it all sorts of sort of fits in. And doing the Duke of Edinburgh, it might sound deep, but it helps you put those pieces together because you're going to be in situations where you don't want to do it. You don't want to keep going. Why am I doing this? What's it for? It's just a piece of paper. It's just this. It's just that. It's nonsense. It's helping you find out about who you are and what you can give to society and how much you can push yourself to be the person that you know deep down you want to be. So the activities that I did for my DV were um, the park run. They had people coming in and running with us, speaking to us and that meant so much. And it's always been something that I've struggled with. <laughs> I don't particularly like doing running at all. Uh, if anything, I try and avoid it. <laughs> but I went every week. It taught me a lot about myself and, and perseverance and not wanting to let anybody down because I'd had so much support. And I was making, um, like they're called snuffle mats for dogs. And the things that we did in Felton with Michelle and, and doing the, the Duke of Edinburgh award. And now I've been released and I've found out that I've actually achieved something amazing. I felt proud that I was doing something. I was making a difference in a slight sort of way. It was fulfilling, which I'd never really had in my life before. The Duke of Edinburgh is a prestigious award. So in life that can never go against you, can it? Because it's the Duke of Edinburgh award. You put that down on a CV and people go, oh, he's done the Duke of Edinburgh. Everyone knows how good the Duke of Edinburgh is. There's no, there's no bad that can come from that. It's like having a university degree. So what I'm doing now is uh, I'm an apprentice carpenter. Um, I've been doing it since I was released from prison and that was in January 2021. And um, yeah, I'm really enjoying it. So my hopes and dreams for the future are probably to uh, be happy and content, whatever that really means. But uh, if I'm always learning and I'm always making sure that I'm the best person that I can be and making life better for other people, I'd say that's where I'd like to be in life.